Hey everyone, welcome to another Tuesday tutorial to help your SEO. So this one is going to be about being able to get your events on uh, Google. So if you go to Google and you just simply type something like car events and you put in any town, and if you do, you'll see that some events come up, right? So how do you get your site, how do you get your information onto Google's events? Well, we'll walk you through a really high level of how to do this. This is not going to be the fine details, but we want to get across the SEO concept first that this exists and to a little bit of some of the links to help you get started down the road. Okay, so the first thing we do is here's your example of course you can do that. Next, if you come to this and I'll put this link in the description below, but this will get you to um, a good part of what Google developers does. And you'll take a look around on this page, get some of the details, but it basically works three different ways. And the first is that if you use, go ahead and use a third party website to do this. And that's maybe the simplest way, but it may cost you a little bit of money to go ahead and get added to some of these sites as they may have a charge depending on the site. The second one is if you're a little bit familiar with a little bit of code, but you don't have access to your HTML, Google provides a data highlighter. And I'll real quick just show you this is what that looks like and I'll also put this link in the description below so that'll walk you through the details behind that and let's go back here to where we can actually uh, use structured data to directly integrate with Google this is going to be the most powerful but probably take the most effort and probably have the most uh, HTML CSS knowledge I don't think you need CSS more I think about it but you're gonna need HTML language you're gonna need code uh, understanding Okay, so if we go ahead and click on that, um, that'll show us how to go ahead and get into the glitch, and then glitch will show you an example of it, and that may be the simplest way uh, to get you started. So basically, you have to have access to your site's HTML, and you have to have access to the head section. So that might be tough if you are in one of these like CMS, like uh, WordPress or any of the others, Wix, where you really can't get into adding scripts quite so easily although if you have enough knowledge you may understand how that's done as well all right so this was just a quick overview to number one let you know that the ability to have an event listed on google is available you can certainly do that and you need to go ahead and understand the three concepts of how to do that third third party sites data highlighter or to actually change your own html and do that all right, thanks, and I hope this is helpful in getting your SEO to drive higher as you add your events and allow Google to be able to add them to their search results. Thanks, and I hope this helps. Mm -hmm.